I'm Verity, Verity Peeps, and I'm the manager here at Portico. And behind me is the Portico of Ards in Porto Ferry. Today, I'm going to tell you all about Joseph Tomalty. He is Porto Ferry's most famous son. So let's go inside. So here we are inside Portico and we're an arts and heritage center and up here is our heritage display. This is a timeline all the way from the ice ages right through to the present. And just here in the 20th century, we have Joseph Tomalty. Joe was born in Porto Ferry in 1911. He was 10 years old when Northern Ireland was created. The partition of Ireland clearly affected him and it was something he returned to later in life in his writing. It was the subject of his most famous, some might say infamous play, The End House, which explored the Special Powers Act of 1922, but it was from a Catholic perspective. It was seen at the time as too controversial to be staged in Northern Ireland. After school, Joe was apprenticed as a painter decorator in Porto Ferry, but the lure of the big city soon had him in Belfast and it was there he began to tread the boards. By the 1940s, he was general manager of the most well-known theatre company in Northern Ireland, the Group Theatre, what's now the Ulster Hall, and he had an impressive acting and writing career. In the 1950s, his stardom really took off with roles in a stream of Hollywood movies, including A Night to Remember, Hobson's Choice and Moby Dick. As if that wasn't enough, he also started writing and, of course, performing in The McCooies, a weekly radio comedy drama series for the BBC. It became the biggest, most popular radio show ever and ran for seven years. They say that the streets were empty when it was on. Here at Portico, we hold arts events of all kinds with music concerts most weekends. Today, we're recreating episodes from the McCooies with Centre Stage Theatre Company. Centre Stage is a theatre company that was set up by Joseph's daughter, Roma Tomalty, who sadly died last year. There are other well-known Tomalty family members too. Frances Tomalty, Joe's other daughter, is also an actress. Joe's brother, Peter, was a well-known singer, recording artist and television presenter. Peter's daughter, Susan, is a blues singer and Francis' son, Joe Sumner, is a singer too. Roma's three daughters are all actresses too, and one of them, Hannah, is here today acting in her grandfather's script. If you'd like to find out more about events at Portico, then check out our website, which is porticoards.com. And if you'd like to find out more about NI100, our borough, our people, go to North Down Museum.